Hi. So today I just want to give a few tips on pregnancy and post-pregnancy. Um, sorry, I'm watching whales and dolphins. It's amazing. Um, see, that's my view. Um, so basically, I just wanted to talk a little bit about the um, observation that happens inside the body physically, mentally and spiritually or energetically and um, just realizing the process that's happening inside of your body. You know, you're going through so many hormonal changes, chemical changes, um, your body is working overdrive to be able to create another life inside of you and so a lot of your energy is going towards this life that's being created inside of you um, and that can deplete feel very depleting for a lot of people so it's very important no matter what's happening in your life at that current time even if you know because life still is very stressful even though you're pregnant you know I, I think I sort of had this view in some ways that life was um you know because i was pregnant like i was going to be like treated like a goddess and walked around on a platter and that doesn't always happen so um you know it, it, stresses in life will continuously pop up in ways that you never imagined while you're still pregnant and it's really important to find that center inside of yourself um to not react to these stresses and to really um, give love, support and nourishment to yourself. Uh, if you have a partner who does that, that's amazing and woohoo um, as well. But it, it's, it's almost like it gets you ready on being a mum to your own self and giving a lot of support and time and not pushing yourself to such an extreme because your body and your mind and your energy, your spirit is going through so much. This is the largest transformation that anybody can go through in life. So it is really important just to give self love to yourself, put yourself in really healing, energizing spaces um, whenever you can uh, and, oh, well, and get loads of rest um, if you're feeling tired those sorts of things you know they're really important and a lot of pregnant women just try and live the life or have to live that life that they were living before they were pregnant um, you know having to go to work dealing with maybe other kids um, a whole bunch of different things but it is super important so we have a thing once I've had baby as well the body has now gone through nine months of creating this life inside of yourself you have built up this uh, huge energy inside of your tummy and all of a sudden you're having to use a whole bunch more energy to push this life into existence um, into the world and, and that's very very draining so we have 40 days we do 40 days where we don't um, where we're going to try and stay just as a close family um, me my partner and baby so that energetically wise people aren't coming in and out of the house it's a, a transition for baby which is really important and it's a transition for me as a mother I can't imagine what it's going to be like not having my son inside of me and feeling him moving and and um, you know it's going to be a really strange thing I'm going to feel uh, like very like that detached sort of uh, feeling like uh, yeah I, I'm gonna feel very attached to baby because he was once inside of me and it's like oh it's such a weird feeling so I can't imagine what it must be like for him to be in such a complete different environment so we have really quiet for 40 days after birth and my partner is going to take care of me for that 40 days um, which is super important because 
that 40 days after birth um, can affect the rest of your life you know you put your body to such an extreme and it's really important that then you recognize that and respond to it uh, in such a way that is going to be healing for that body and your body and your energy it's like a giant black hole that is left behind energetically um, in your tummy where you know in your uterus where this baby was once being created and you really need to refill that as well as also your breastfeeding so you're still going through this process of having to give a lot of your energy a lot of your nutrients and um, the chemical imbalancements and hormone imbalancements within the body are trying to readjust to the new um, environment that your body is going through so really important to just recognize all these things eat really healthy um, and to give lots of love support and nurture to yourself and keep those sorts of people around you that are going to give you that love nurture and support and yeah bring a positive energy into the space and to just try and get you I mean like I'm super lucky that I'm in this beautiful house with right next to the ocean which is just so healing um, and I don't really need to go anywhere like I can just stay here at home but after the 40 days like do try and get yourself out into really healing spaces and um, rejuvenate yourself as much as you possibly can because you do go through such an intense experience and it's very hard sometimes for other partners to understand this because like I've worked with children my whole life and mothers and I thought I knew a lot about babies and children and what it was to be a mother but being pregnant it's like no it's so different for each individual person but it's so hard to describe to somebody like you have to really experience it to understand it and I can understand for men or other women who haven't been through it it is very hard to relate to or, or to completely understand and to then respond correctly to that so um, communication is the best key and just trying to really observe yourself observe the fact that you know you might be feeling down but that's because there's this huge transformation happening inside of your body and to not sort of hold attachment to that and react and to more respond uh, in healthy manners so and anicca anicca means you know everything's in constant change so it will all change again so if you are feeling a bit down or anything just recognize that it is something that it will change your chemical imbalancement will change again um, yeah just stay stay true and stay with lots of love and support and nurture for yourself and for your baby blessings <laughs>